it's 2 a.m. <laughs> and I'm here I'm trying to write this not yet existent but beautiful theatre piece. <laughs> Knowing full well that I need to go up at 6 a.m. for work, which, by the way, is at a posh bakery that claims everything is homemade when everything comes packaged, so. And people are paying like four pounds for a tiny pot of fruit salad. Ugh. You know, I get thoughtful sometimes. Like when I get a chance to actually see what's happening with me. And I just feel like I'm living in the highlight of my life. You know, just, just living day by day, not knowing what's gonna happen, but I just know everything will be okay. <laughs> this will probably be one of the only monologues talking about feeling good. Everyone always says that writers get their best inspiration when they're sad. What about the people that put a smile on anything, you know? Mm, like that guy from work. Man, he puts a smile on everything he told me after 10 days of knowing me that his brother got shot in the head in a nightclub just leaving behind his pregnant girlfriend they never even found out who did it and this guy's away from home god he barely speaks english for christ's sake and yet every single morning he is singing bachata, salsa, and reggaeton, and just, oh God, he greets you with the biggest smile, and he asks you how your day's been. Like, for real. Man, I don't know where I'm going with my life. But I just feel, I just feel very good. You know, I'm just enjoying this ride to God knows where. Just mumbling, trembling, troubling, just not knowing. is the place where I want to be.